The final night of the 65th annual Big Rock Blue Marlin Tournament Saturday was definitely one to remember. The path to the scales was a long one for the crew of Sensation after they hooked their fish at 2.15 p.m just 45 minutes before the deadline. And after more than a six hour battle, they boated a blue marlin around 8.20 p.m. Kind of end of the day, so we put the lines back out for one last shot, turned the boat around and started heading out to the deep. And next thing we know, we see this monster come crashing in. The boat brought the marlin back to Big Rock Landing a little after 11 p.m. It's everybody from the turn basin all the way to Big Rock Landing. It's, uh, we really appreciate the support from the community um, we, it just, it touched our hearts, uh, it's something I always remember. However, the cheers didn't last long, as officials discovered the fish had what appeared to be shark bites on it. A decision to rule on if the marlin qualified was pushed to Sunday morning, which did not please the crowd on hand who wanted to know what it weighed, which wasn't initially shared. Weigh the fish! Weigh the fish! The fish was finally weighed, coming in unofficially, at 619.4 pounds. The morning though, the committee ruled after consulting with experts that the fish had been mutilated before it was landed or boated, resulting in its disqualification. Uh, it's, it's very disheartening. The ruling made the crew of sushi the official winner of the Big Rock Blue Marlin Tournament with their fish weighing 484.5 pounds and taking home a combined total of over $7.2 million. Captain Charlie Pereira said they almost tossed the fish back because they didn't think it was big enough. We just prayed and prayed and I looked away and prayed looking at the other the ocean inlet direction and I heard the crowd scream and my guys scream and roar and everything. So I figured we'd done something right and uh, turns out we, we did well.